Good evening to your television viewers. Today we are welcoming you from the studio. Last week a number of official events were held in the Autonomous Republic. A memorial event was held in honor of the November Bumates were organized by the plenipotential representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic and the Nakhchivan Mates Families Public Union. In addition, the plenipotential representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, Fuad Najafli, visited Sadat. Derek Kengerli, Sharur and Babek districts and Medwet residents. More details in the official news blog. According to the November 27th decree of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan, Ilham Aliyev, Azad Novruzov was terminated from his job as director of Nakhchivan Teachers Institute. The plenipotentiary representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, Fat Nejefli, visited Sederek, Kengerli, Sharur and Babak districts and met with residents. The plenipotentiary representative visited the monuments of the national leader Heder Aliyev in the district's centers and paid tribute to his dear memory. Then, reception events of citizens were held in the district executive powers. Fad Najafli had individual and mutual conversations with residents, including families of matters and veterans, as well as listened to their appeals and problems. It was stated that all appeals will be recorded and appropriate measures will be taken to solve them. A conference on the topic of state and religion relations in the context of geopolitical realities and global summons was held in Nakhchivan on November 30th, organized by the State Committee on Work with Religious Institutions. The conference began with the national anthem of the Republic of Azerbaijan being played. Fad Najafli, the plenipotentiary representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, conducted his introduction speech and spoke about the importance of large-scale measures implemented in the field of preserving our religious and moral values under the leadership of the national leader Heydar Aliyev. The conference continued with panel discussions on the topics of state and religion relations in the context of ideological security and return to national spiritual values, traditions and modernity. The memorial event organized by the plenipotential representative office of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic and the Nakhchivan Martis Families Public Union was attended by state and government representatives, members of the Martis families, veterans, servicemen, students and public representatives. A video material prepared by Nakhchivan Television regarding the November War Martis was watched and students came to the stage with portraits of 32 martyrs whose names were mentioned in the very video material. Mate Ali Babayev's sister, Maryam Velieva, and Mate Abbasali Nazaraliyev's daughter, Shevket Nazaraliyeva, spoke at the very event. The event continued with an artistic part. Roads are prepared in Nakhchivan within the framework of a state program. Within the framework of the implementation of the state program on the socio-economic development of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic for 2023-27, the roads of the Asabi Kev Religious and Cultural Monument Complex, Julfa City and Daradag Arsene Le Water Treatment Center have been repaired. On November 30, the plenipotential representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, Fuad Najafli, got acquainted with repaired work carried out on the roads. On the 29th of November, a conference was held in Nakhchivan on the topic of the impact of climate change on the development of agriculture. The participants of the conference jointly organized by the ministries of agriculture of the Republic of Azerbaijan as well as Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic visited the monument of the national leader Heder Aliyev in the main square of Nakhchivan city and led flowers in front of it. 
Samir Seyid Ahmetli, Deputy Plenipotentiary Representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, wished success and expressed confidence that the conference would contribute to strengthen required measures to combat climate change. During the speeches, 2024 being declared as the Green World Solidarity Year in the Republic of Azerbaijan and COP29 being held in Azerbaijan were evaluated as important contributions. Video clips dedicated to COP29 and green energy projects in Nakhchivan were demonstrated at the conference. The conference continued with panel discussions on the topics of the role of climate in sustainable agriculture, food and water supply, as well as scientific approaches and increasing human resources potential. Nakhchivan store branch of Aras supermarkets chain has started operating. On November 30th, Fuad Najafli, the plenipotentiary representative of the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, got acquainted with the new supermarket in Nakhchivan city. It should be noted that 13 stores of Aras and Oba market chains have been commissioned in Nakhchivan. As a result, 150 new jobs were opened in Nakhchivan. The sale of goods produced by local farmers is also given priority at the market. A meeting with foreign professors was held at Nakhchivan State University. The emergency medical service is fully prepared for the winter season. More details in our next news block. A meeting with foreign professors was held at Nakhchivan State University. Speaking at the meeting, Rector of Nakhchivan State University El Burisisayev noted that 16 foreign professors and teachers, including Japan, United States of America and Turkey, were involved in teaching at the university to engage in the training, teaching and research activities in 2024-25 academic year. Turkey's Kars Kafkas University Professor Issa Özaydın, Istanbul University Zarepaşa Associate Professor Aysel Ersoy, the same university professor Rüya Şamlı, Kayseri University Professor Musa Karabacak and other teachers gave information about the classes held. It was noted that the implementation of the mobility in the framework of the effective international cooperation established with the prestigious higher education institutions of Turkey create an ideal basis for the formation of the students' knowledge skills and habits on the more progressive basis. The Minister of Youth and Sports of the Nakhchivan Republic organized a new campaign in Youth Park. As part of the Year of Solidarity for Green World initiative, Youth planted 75 fruit saplings in the area. It is worth noting that Youth Park was established in 2018 to mark Nakhchivan's designation as the Youth Capital. The event organized by the Minister of Ecology and Natural Resources of Nakhchivan Republic was closely attended by the staff of the television and radio broadcasting close joint stock company, the state capital on family, women and children's problems, and Shack Opposite newspaper. A total of the 4,300 seedlings were planted on the 4 hectare area by the joint work of the collectives. Dear television viewers, now we continue with sports and culture news. An event dedicated to the creativity of honored artist, singer Hunar Aliyev was held at the Nakhchivan State National Drama Theatre. Hassan Seido, Deputy Minister of Culture of Nakhchivan Republic, spoke about the life and creativity of Hunar Aliyev in the event. In the artistic part of the event, accompanied by the song and dance ensemble of the Nakhchivan State Philharmonic, honored artist Hunar Aliyev, Zulfikar Mamadov, Vilayat Ismailov, Presidential Prize winner Narmin Husseinova performed Mughams, various folk songs were performed and greeted with applause. In the celebration of the 100th anniversary of the Nakhchivan Republic, a regional kickboxing championship for youth was held at the Inhamaliyev Olympic Sports Complex. The opening ceremony began with the minute of silence in the memory of the national leader Heydar Aliyev and the martyrs, followed by the playing of the national anthem. 
addressing the event, Deputy Minister of Youth and Sports and Acting Minister Majid Seido, along with the Chairman of the Kickboxing Federation, Khayal Abdullayev, highlighted the achievements of the state's sport policy under the leadership of President Ilham Aliyev. During the ceremony, athletes who achieved the success at national and international levels were honored with certificates. The championship then commented with over 70 athletes from the various cities and districts of the Autonomous Republic participating. Competitors, including both boys and girls, competed across two age categories and various weight branches. Winners of the top three positions were awarded certificates, medals and gifts in recognition of their achievements. Isim Television Watchers, that was all for today. Hoping to be together next week at the same time. Thanks for watching us. Have a good night.